Hi everybody, I'm Reese Witherspoon and I'm here answering some questions from people in New York City. This should be interesting. Hi Reese. Hey Reese. Hey Reese. Reese, I have a question. Hey Reese Witherspoon. So I just wanted to know in Legally Blonde, you said getting into Harvard wasn't hard. And I'm trying to get into med school, so do you have any tips? Um, yes, don't listen to movies. That was a lie. It's really, really hard to get into Harvard. It's really hard. So, we all know that you kissed Chris Pine, yeah? So, how was it? <laughs> really nice. He's an excellent kisser. And also, a really funny actor. I just gotta know, how did you clone your beautiful daughter into you? Oh, um, well actually I've never told anybody before, but um, a team of scientists at Stanford made her in a test tube. And that's why we look exactly alike. I don't know. She and I just look alike. I don't know why. I look exactly like my mom, and she looked exactly like her mom. It's a Witherspoon thing. As an actor, what's the most dramatic face you can make? The most dramatic face I can make? Well, I do my serious face when my kids are in trouble, and it's like this. And I said, do you see my serious face? Don't do that. I don't like that. And then I go, ha, ha, ha. Tricked him. I'm from Houston, Texas, so I just want to know, is there hot sauce in your bag? Swag. <laughs> Hi, honey. Um, there is not hot sauce in my bag, but I do like some Cholula. <laughs> I do like some spicy shrimp and grits. That's a good question, and you're cute. Hi, Reese. Why Hi. do you create art? What is it about art that you love, and why are you an ambassador of the arts? You're a beautiful artist. Oh, thank you. Um, I create art because I think it is a way to change and shift ideas and culture. And I think when we see things in movies that we've never seen before, it changes the way we see other people. And I think that encourages compassion and kindness and humanity, which is very important right now. You ever had any moments on set that everyone couldn't stop laughing? Yeah, I'm in my last movie, Home Again. <laughs> there was a really funny moment on set where it was Nancy Meyer's birthday and two of the actors decided to do a strip tease for her, which was maybe the funniest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. They came in fireman outfits and started dancing and um, we all just had to go home. It was that funny. <laughs> hey Reese, here's a question. I'm wondering, what are you really passionate about that has nothing to do with work or family? Oh, that's a great question. I'm very passionate about women's issues, women's health care. I'm also really passionate about creating more female storytellers in this world, whether you're a director or photographer. I just want to see more women telling their stories. Alexa, like what's your favorite kind of steak? Porterhouse, T-bone, <laughs> filet mignon? I'm really curious. You know, that's a great question. I'm a filet mignon girl. That's just what I am. It's what I like. Have you ever had a director ask you to do something that's completely unrealistic, like cry from the left eye? And if so, how do you approach it? Yes, I once had a director ask me to ride a horse, two horses, with one foot on one horse and one foot on the other horse, to ride a horse like that, standing up. And apparently only three people in the history of time have accomplished that. But for some reason, this director thought I could do it. And I just looked at him and I was like, I don't think so. You're going to have to hire a stunt girl. He said, will you try it? I said, nope. Because <laughs> I want to make some other movies after this. <laughs> I would like to know, have you ever ridden a mechanical bull? Wow, that's very specific. No, I haven't. <laughs> That sounds really uncomfortable and somewhat painful. Not interested in running a mechanical bowl. What is the best southern food? The best southern food for me is probably fried chicken. There's nothing like hot, spicy fried chicken and you get the best at Hattie B's in Nashville, Tennessee. So go there and check it out and say I sent you. <laughs> Hey Reese, what's your normal bedtime? Gosh, my normal bedtime, I don't sleep very much. So usually I go to bed around 11.30 and I wake up around 5.30. Do the bend and snap moves still work? Of course they do. They work every time. 